Mullen Ares, Mullen fan, we back with another one. Let me tell you why I am not worried about this price action today. I told you guys that 47 cents was holding strong up until the point they started manipulating the stock during pre-market. And you know, pre-market hours is where the shorts will and market makers will try to do their most criminal activity. And the reason why is because a lot of traders, a lot of investors are not able to trade in the stock market between the hours of 4 a.m. and 9 a.m. And I know so, a lot of y'all using Robinhood app too. So if you use a Robinhood or any other of these brokerage apps, make sure you turn off share lending. You can Google that to turn off share lending. So these market makers cannot use your shares, borrow your shares to short into the market. We talked about 47 cents. If it breaks, then it will be finding the next level of support. And right now, 38 cents, we are seeing a bounce off of I am so. confident that Mullinaires are holding out there. And remember, they wanted you to sell at 21 cents. Where's the 15 cent piece of guy? Mm. This price action today may have some people forgetting that Mullins Automotive Strikingly Different Tour is still ongoing. Where are we going next? We're going to Las Vegas, Nevada. Where we the going? next leg of the tour is going to be featuring the Mullin 5 RS, which is proclaimed to be one of the fastest EVs you can build. It's tour season. If you don't think David Mystery has another banger press release revealing the amount of pre-orders that he's received over the course of all these showcasings, then you better think twice. An investor place says five big dogs that's betting against Mullen Automotive. And guess who's on the list? One and only Citadel Advisors, aka the market maker and the people that short the stocks. And market. you might think, why would people bet against Mullen Automotive at the time where the tours are starting and more eyes and attention is on Mullen Automotive stock? Because they're controlling the stock, but they can only control it up to the point where a banger is released and there's momentum in the play that squeezes these shorts out. And of course, pre-market hours where no one's really trading the stocks, just short sending in a whole bunch of selling pressure to the stock. You know what it is, your boy Finesse Monster. Stay charged up. Hope y'all find this information valuable. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and I'll catch y'all next one. I'm gone.